the electric field equals to sigma over 2 epsilon naught here. And if we write this thing in vectorial form, then this will be the vector form and here we will have this is normal to the surface. The electric field is normal to the surface along the, the direction and we are having the electric field of an infinite sheet of charges like this. We can discuss the solution here. Is here we know that electric field of a sphere, electric field of a line charge, electric field of a cylinder, they are all dependent on the distance from the sheet, uh, dependent on the distance from the source. But if I look here, here the electric field is completely constant. This is sigma over 2 epsilon naught. Sigma is constant. 2 epsilon naught is constant. So electric field is constant. The reason for this is that we have considered an infinite sheet of charge. This is not finite. If this would be finite, we will uh, we would have a decreasing field. As this is infinite, so that's why we will have um, a constant field and it will not be decreasing. This is the, for example, if the observation point is here, then these are the charges which are in interaction here. And as I remove this one here, then the distance is increasing and the area is increasing. The interaction area are the number of charges coming in this field of view or this interaction is increasing. And as I go away from this one, more and more charges are coming into action, which keeps the electric field to be the same and not decrease at all. So that's the reason that we are having a constant electric field.